you're having issues in your relationship and all of a sudden this glaring light comes in because it's Valentine's Day where you're celebrating your relationship and, you know, and it's meaning that you're supposed to be happy and excited about the relationship. And right now you're not in that position. So it's. And also Valentine is a day when people like to do surprises. Yeah. <laughs> Surprise. <laughs> Surprise. It's an interesting emotion. It's one of the, those powerful emotions that dysregulates people, whether it's a positive surprise, a negative surprise, people get thrown off their balance. I recommend that everything becomes a little bit more explicit during this holiday. You know, I'm planning a, a dinner for us tonight, or I'm planning for us to go out, or I'm going to bring some flowers and cards for you because it's so important to let each other know what you're doing. So there's no surprises. When you keep things secret, then the other partner doesn't know what's happening. They may think that uh, a card would be sufficient. You know, I, I love you. I tell you I love you every day. We just were intimate last night. And of course I love you, right? Yeah, and the yeah. other person goes overboard, flowers and chocolates and everything yeah, else. Yeah. And then and then, and then you, you end up in almost like inequality, right, of, of love. Yeah. I love you more. So it, it's nice to let each other know what's happening. Don't keep yeah. it in the dark. Talk about it. Discuss it. Even now. Today, as we're talking about, you know, look at your partner and just tell them, you know, uh, this is what I'm planning to do. The thought behind the Valentine is to reaffirm the relationship, reaffirm love and reaffirm the fact that I'm with this person who is so special for me. And I don't want to be with anyone else except you. I think yeah. if we take that spirit during this holiday, it will bring different meaning to our right. relationship. And it's a renewal. For me, the Valentine is a renewal date. When you renew your commitment to each other, when you renew your love to each other and you reassure the other person that yeah. they're, they're still the ones you love and they're still for you. And, uh, and being financially savvy in these, during this type of holiday is also important. You know, if, if, if there's a low resources, you can still uh, let your partner know how much you love them without spending $100, $200 on it. You know, how you start your day is really important. And how do you maintain that connection throughout the day with your partner? It's almost like we're going a little bit over, we need to go a little bit overboard and, and send a nice messages, put some emojis with a smile and hearts and, and explanation sign and 100% sign, something to let her know that, and continuously reinforcing your partner, letting them know that they're not alone evolutionary part of our, our lives, you know, as, as humans, uh, we're kind of long for connection. And being alone is very uncomfortable and unsafe place for a long period of times. So we want to find somebody. And, and there's many people who do want to find the partner, but don't know how, or maybe they're afraid. Maybe they had breakups that was so difficult that they don't want to get into a relationship again. And they worry if they get into a relationship again, they're going to hurt, get hurt again. So maybe the word for, for, for people in this situation is uh, there is hope. There is hope. And there, there is a partner for you that will care and love you and protect you. And to be in love, that means risking. Risking uh, your emotions and risking your vulnerability yeah. and risking um, being hurt. And, then, and maybe the hope is that you'll find the person who will want to be for the rest of your life and their lives probably the valentine's day is reaffirm your commitment to each other that's number one number two no surprises if you can keep you keep everything and everybody in the loop your partner your friends whoever you, you you is close to you number three realize that there is help don't give up on your relationship 